Daddy's kitchen. Hello, Father. Hi. How are you? I'm great, wonderful. Look Thank at you, God. liming in that lime green. Yeah. Okay, I like it. I like it. It's giving. It's giving bright. It's giving excited. All right. I love it. It's giving tropical vibes. Yeah, man. I love it. I love it. I love it. So we just want to say hello to our family. We love you guys. Hi. We are here yet again in the kitchen. I'm Monago, we are no time. Daddy, without further ado, tell the people them where we are cooked today. Why well, may I cook some brown stew pork, you know? Brown stew pork. pork. Yes. Jamaican brown stew pork. That yeah, is. Man. I am so excited because I'm just I'm I'm ready for a nice warm meal. Now, Daddy, before this, I was I was guys, I was I was I was uh what do I what can I say? I was. Say, uh, say, say, say. <laughs> I, no, I, I would never cuss, Daddy. Never, ever, ever. But <laughs> I was, I was saying to him, Daddy, oh, you cut up the things before you show the people them how to cut it up, okay? And he's like, oh, they know, they know. But no, I think he trusts you guys so much, and he believes that you guys are such perfection that you already know. But I just want to remind him that, you know, there's some people who don't know how to cut up a whole roast. And one of those people is me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we're going to try and make do. So it was a full roast and Daddy's going to show us how he kind of cut it, cuts it up. But, you know, not necessarily from the, the beginning when it was a big roast, but, you know, we're going to make do. People, I'm so sorry. It's okay. This, it's okay. But I'm going to show you how I do it. I have a big piece of roast pork, mm -hmm. and so what I do, I just cut it up piece by piece. Little by little. Little by little, like that, and I just cut it like that, okay. in cubes, okay? Okay. Again, this is a piece of bone, but the meat is on it, I just cut off a oh, piece. Oh, that's good to know, because like, do you leave the that's bone right in there? there? Yes. Then you suck on this bone, man, when it's cooked, nice. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you do like that again. Okay. okay. Nice little cues. Okay, yeah. so basically you just take the roast and cut it up into the bite yeah. sizes that yes. you want. Yes. Okay. All right. So I understand why you would have thought that wasn't that important to show, but I know what's more important is all of this and the seasoning. So let's get into it, Danny. What do we have? Okay, I have some ginger right here. Okay. Fresh ginger, garlic, scotch bunny pepper, mm -hmm. and I have the, the purple one here. Okay. Dark one. Mm -hmm. Peppers, sweet peppers. We have green, yellow, orange, orange. thyme, scallion, onions, and little tomatoes. Okay. And I'm gonna dump everything inside. Inside of the pork. Yes. So I heard someone I think the other day saying that oh. These type of seasonings don't need to be in the pot with in the raw meat. It can be done separately or it should be done separately. How do you feel about that, no, Father? You do what you feel like doing. Tell them again. Tell them for my this, damn business. This oh. is the original way. I know. Mm-hmm. I think a lot of people like nowadays, they're always like, well, technically, well, now, well, we need to release ourselves yes. or like all kinds of stuff. And it's just like, or if it ain't broke, don't fix it. If, you want, to, if you want to change things, you change it. Of course. That's the wonderful yeah, thing. About that's your this. way. Yeah. But don't come and don't come and try and diss the people them who have been doing it. Right? No, you don't do that. I agree. You don't do that. I agree. Do the things that you want to do. I do what I do, and I'm teaching people how to do it. This is coming from from my ancestors. Mm -hmm. Way back. Way back, Way before back. Instagram. Yes. So, please. Now, bada with it. Okay, I mix it up. All of it. With your hands, just kind of get with it. With my hands, you see. Okay. And this is all my seasoning that I'm going to put in it. Okay, so we have... I have some soy sauce, brown in here right here. Okay. Black pepper. Mm hmm Meat seasoning. Mm hmm Maggi. Sister Maggi. Okay. Seasoned salt. Okay. I have some pimentos. Mm hmm Flavor rice. Mm hmm 
flavor. Garlic powder. Mm -hmm. And Sister Maggie again. And Sister Maggie again. Different flavor. But different flavor. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, so what we gonna do? I'm gonna put some Sister Maggie on. Sister Maggie, because you already know how we feel about Sister Maggie. Yes. Lots of flavor in this. Sister Maggie packs the flavor, okay? So you don't wanna, and we call her Sister Maggie, but <laughs> just to be clear, you don't go to the grocery store and ask for Sister Maggie. It's <laughs> Just to make sure you know, it's actually just Maggie seasoning, okay? <laughs> but we call her Sister Maggie here because, you know, you have to give her a little respect, Shabbat. Yeah, yeah. Right? Okay, I have some soya sauce browning right here. Soya sauce, soya sauce. Not too much, about two tablespoons. Okay, about two tablespoons. If I remember you have Sister Maggie in there and this is a little bit salty. Okay. So is this? A little bit salty also. Okay, so just be careful. Yes, be careful how, you, how much you put. And if you're new here, we are a low sodium type of family. We get seasonings without sodium, so just keep that in mind. Yeah. Black pepper. Tablespoon of black pepper. Just one tablespoon? Yeah. Okay. I have scotchy. I have scotch bite in here. Mm -hmm. Meat seasoning. Meat seasoning. Uh, One tablespoon. From Cool Runnings, by the way. Shout out to Cool Runnings. They always show us love. Cool Runnings. <laughs> you got the best, man. <laughs> Sister all Maggie, but, but all purpose for All it. purpose seasoning. Yeah. I'll put a table and a half. Tablespoon and a half. Seasoning salt, just a little bit. I mean, a, a teaspoon. Just a teaspoon. Yeah. You see how I'm in chintzy with the salt? Yeah, because remember these are salt. Mhm. Mm pimento. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grind up some of these pimentos. I'm sure right in it. Oh, you're grinding them this time. Yeah. Interesting. Usually you mm -hmm. just throw them in. Yeah. What? When you grind it, more flavor comes out of it. Okay. One. And now your favorite. Flavor rice. Look on that. That's one big tablespoon. That's one pick of a Jamaican I, tablespoon. I, I put two tablespoons. Two Jamaican tablespoons. Because this is all vegetable. Right, the herbs. All vegetable. Mm. Garlic powder. Garlic mm. powder. Tablespoon. And you know, sir, I feel how I feel about garlic. Mm, this is my I know, it's making me sneeze too. <laughs> <laughs> bless your father, bless you. All the time. Yeah, I literally just held back two sneezes. <laughs> Don't wait it back, let it go. Yeah, but you know, I can't let it go by the food, you know? Oh, pimento. Pimento, you're going to blend it up. Yeah. How are you going to do that? Okay, pimento. That's what I do. If if you can't do it like how I do it, you just put a piece of paper over it, over the pimento, and you use your knife, and I press down. So you're strong. Interesting. If you're not that strong, get, use something and beat it. Crush it. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, peppercorn, peppercorn. Wait, is this what peppercorn is? Lord of mercy. <laughs> I just had a moment. Yeah. Is this not, no, or is it the same? Is it not this the same? This is pimento. This is pimento, but it looks a Different lot like peppercorn. peppercorn. Yeah, because you crush it. Okay. And you just sprinkle it all over. Oh. Just give it lots of flavor. Mm. Tell me down in the comments if you know. This pot is about to be a flavorful pot. Guys, look at this. Come on now. Come on now. You ain't never had a, 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 a stew pork. Is it stew pork? Brown stew pork. Brown stew pork quite like this. Look upon the seasoning that man. Just turn up. Yep. You have to lick your 10 finger and your 10. I'm going in it with my 10 fingers. Daddy, you didn't even finish. The thing that I was supposed to, you were supposed to say 10 toes. 
Oh. <laughs> you can't read the mind, you know, sister. Daddy, my f ten, you're not gonna lick your ten, ten finger, finger and, and your ten toe. Thank you, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> okay. I'm Let's see the nails. Very clean. Clean, clean, clean. So this is your reminder. Go wash your hand and clean up the nails, them, and have no dirt under the nails before you knead up people food. Okay. Okay. Now I'm gonna rub it in. Good smell, these people. The smell. The smell, the smell, the smell. Wow. Okay. So this one. Mm hmm. I'm gonna put it in a zip bag and freeze it because I season the one that I'm gonna cook today overnight. Oh, yesterday. So you're a genius, is what you're saying. You say it. Oh, so that one's going away for a later day. Yes. And so, you already did this. Yes, because I want wow. to marinate overnight. Okay, so that the flavor could be buzzing. Yes, yes. Mm. So mm. because I want to show you how I do it, I have to do this one. Okay, oh, okay. Daddy, you love them. Yes, I You do. love them. Guys, you can't say that we don't love you because look at the dedication. This is like, what, two days in advance, okay? Mm. I love this. Okay, so this has been soaking for what? How long? Overnight. Overnight. Mm -hmm. So, turn up. Turn up. Everything soft and nice. So when you cook this, oh my gosh. Where did this come from? Are we putting it on top of white rice? Please tell me we're putting it on top of white rice. Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. Yes. Woo. <laughs> okay, I turn on my stove and hi. On high? Yeah. What kind of oil are you using? Vegetable oil. Okay, no bougie oil today. I'm not putting a lot of oil. Okay. Okay. Why not? Because the pork have some fat on it. Okay, 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 okay. So there's already enough fat. Yes. All right. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to not the, the seasoning of the fruit seasoning. Just oh. like that. Okay, so you knock the physical, like the piece seasonings yeah. off. Okay. Why do you do that? Because I don't want them to burn. Okay. So I want because I want this to brown first. Then okay. I had the season. Oh. Okay. Are it hot? Something is flat? Smell what it smells like in here right now. Woo. You would do a praise dance. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, this is all the seasoning that left over, the fruit seasoning. So I'm gonna leave this. I'm gonna give this a stir. A and let stir? It, yeah, and let it brown. 
Okay. And then I cover it and leave it, let it cook. When it's ready to, when it's ready brown and nice, mm -hmm. I'm gonna add the season to it. Okay. And put a little water in it and let it cook. Okay. So let's see that stir then, huh? Yeah. Okay. I'm not stirring it yet. Let it keep going. Oh, you're gonna let it sit for a little bit? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna give this pot a stir right now. Okay. right now is cover it and let it sweat okay. and brown at the same time okay okay it is start to sweat the liquid coming out sweating yes so if I cover it it's gonna sweat more you're gonna, gonna bring its own liquid and that's what you want and that's what I want okay so you cover it yes okay make it sweat so what's next, Daddy? What are we doing next? Okay. When you have enough water in it, now and get brown, I'm gonna add the seasoning to it. Okay, okay, With okay. A little water, give it a stir and cover it and let it cook. Okay. Yeah. All right, I won't rush it. I'll let you do you, and we'll be back when it's time to do the do. All the mercy. <laughs> So I'm a big believer that there is no such thing as a stupid question. And for people like me, Daddy, who, you know, eventually will spread our wings and live on our own someday. <laughs> um, how do you prepare this to go back into the fridge? Like you said that you seasoned it and then you just like put it away. Is that yeah, it? It's not going into the fridge. It's going into the freezer. Oh, it's going into the freezer. Yes. So why can't it go into the I'm, fridge? No, you're going to spoil it because you don't know when you're going to use it. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. So you freeze it. That's a good way okay. to do it. Okay. To do all your meats. Okay. You can cut them up, season them, and put them in a zip bag left. Bag. Okay. And, and freeze them. And when you want it, you take it out a day before. Okay. When you're going to use it, take it out a day before that you can tie it out. And take it from your freezer to your fridge. Oh. Okay. So don't That's take the best it from way the to freezer do. and put it in a hot boiling no, water. No, no. From your freezer to your fridge. You can even pull it out if you know it's gonna, not going to tie it out in one day. Pull it out two days before. Okay. And put it in your fridge. Let it tie it out in your fridge. Okay. Much better. Okay. Because you, you leave it outside, it can spoil. Okay, good to know because I would have had a lot of spoiled meats. <laughs> Yes, that's the best way to do it. And when you cook this now, everything marinates nice and more flavor. All the flavor is trapped right into the meat. Mm. Yes. Okay. Well, there you have it, guys. This is how you preserve, especially in these times. You just never know what's going to happen. Yeah. Put your meat inside the freezer. Look at, look at that. See oh, all so that, baby? The juices in there too? Of course. That's where the flavor is. Ah. Well, I'll be. Lord of mercy. I knew you were going to do that. <laughs> <laughs>
With a little water and let it cook. And by seasoning, he means this seasoning, guys. Because yeah. it's already seasoned up. But... Okay. I'm about to show y'all my favorite little pieces. Get one piece that right one the right You see how you know me, daddy? <laughs> you know me. Yeah, man. <laughs> That one is calling my name. All right. Okay, I'm gonna cover it again. And check it one more time. And then my season can go with him. Okay. All right. All right. Tato. Tato. Okay, second test. Mm -hmm. So let's see it dried out. You can see it. So, okay. okay. I'm gonna one. turn. I'm gonna turn it. So, the, you see how it looks like it's burning at the bottom? Okay. That's a good thing, right? Yes, it's caramelized. Caramelized. Right. You consider it caramelization. Yeah. Kind of like that. Good thing here. Yeah. So, because I would always be like, oh, but it's burning. He's like, no, it's supposed to do that because the color and the flavor. And so, see that now? When I put some water in it, mm -hmm. all these gonna turn into gravy. Gravy. At the bottom right there. Mm -hmm. You see, I get the color that I need right now. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna add in my seasoning. Ooh. Put some water in this to wash out. Get all the flavors from the container. Right into it. Then I'm gonna star. Star. <laughs> star. When you say stir, it's so funny. Though. See what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Guys, if you could smell this, my. My, my, my. My, 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 my. I'm gonna put some more water in it. It's not enough water right here now. Okay. Okay, so you put more. Yes. See, I would be afraid of that because I'm like, is it gonna make it not flavorful anymore? Yes. It's, yeah, it's gonna afraid. take it away? No. Oh, so you're like, yes. <laughs> you mean, no. Yeah. Flavor's still gonna be trapped up in there. Yeah, it's not going nowhere. Okay. So this um, is the stew part. Yeah. So, okay. what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add a little ketchup. Good old ketchup. Good old ketchup. Guys, do you remember when I was so shocked that ketchup went into oxtail and stew and not stew but brown stew? I'm still pretty shocked. I am still pretty shooketh. Mm -hmm. Don't shock. Shake it, little bit, no one. Oh, there you go. D. Interesting. Still so interesting to me. Very, 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 very interesting. <laughs> Let me start. So what's the pot on right now? It's a medium right now. I'm going to turn it right back up. Right back up to high. Yeah. Okay. And people, when it's cooked, almost cooked, right there. Look. Look at that little piece with the little fat on top. I'm gonna add some butter bean to it. Butter bean, what you mean? Butter bean, that's what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Okay, daddy. Okay, that's it. I'm gonna let it cook right now. So back no, to the... No interfere. Okay. So wait, are we covering it? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Okay. 
Okay, people. Okay. Yeah, check the pot. Yeah, check the pot. Look, look at that. It's almost finished, you know? Wee, wee, wee. Look at that. Look at the little piece there, guys. Look at piece. Wow. Yeah, go try that for pizza. Oh my gosh, oh my god, oh my gosh, daddy, don't do this to me. Oh my god. do I can do it. Oh. I'm serving you. So you're saying so you're saying that it's, it's pretty much done. Almost. You, you tell me? Look at that. That that whole that whole little section right let, let it breeze off a little bit. That one's mine. Woo! Yeah, I don't think what I've been now. So you're gonna add the butter bean now. Yeah, if it cook, check it. Okay, let me check. Let me check. Test that. It's hot enough. Careful. I know. Woo! I think that maybe that piece off me. Mm hmm. Five more minutes. Mm -hmm. The paper turn up. It's sweet. The paper turn up. No, I don't taste no paper turn up. Let me taste Let me try it. Look at the gravy, people. You're getting wimpy, daddy. Yes. Look at the gravy, how nice it is. Ooh, guys, oh my goodness. That piece? That over a bed of white rice, and you're gonna, and he's gonna add the broad bean. Hmm. How much, how much bean do you think I should put in this? I think you should do one, one can. One? You wanna do two? I don't know. I think one can is enough. One can is enough? Okay. Well, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Okay, I'm gonna give this five more minutes, and then I had it, the butter bean. Okay, let's do it. You get your butter bean them? Yeah, man, right there. Okay, let's look, let's see what brand. Daddy Grace. always use the same brand, right? Grace, pretty much. Dry lima beans, butter beans, y'all. You feel like there should be two in there, shouldn't you? don't you? Yeah. Okay, Daddy, do what you feel. It's okay. Yeah, we're not needing it. Okay. Guys. Listen, let me tell you something. When I told you guys that you're gonna lick your ten finger and, and your ten, ten toe, toe, I wasn't joking. Okay. Butter bean. And you put the butter beans in late because you don't want them to mash out, right? That is soft. They're very soft. But they're so good, and when they soak up that gravy, you guys, oh, <laughs> just yummy. This is done. Enough. This is done. No, no, say it done. It's a calming name. Look at that gravy. It's calling. Oh my gosh. Oh, that over your white rice, honey, honey, honey. Then why you have to be so bad with it, man? Uh, you have to. You have to? You have to. You don't have to. Yeah, man. It seems like you really you have, have to. You put out the best. The best. The best of the best. You only, know? right? Yeah, only. Wow. So, i give this a minute. Just for the beans to soak it on up. Yeah. And, and then... It's over. And then it's time to share out their meal? Yeah, man. So we have to get them plate ready? Yeah, man. On the ready with your plate? Your mind, you play the right beside me. <laughs> that was for them to answer, Daddy. I know they're ready with their yeah, plate. May I answer for them too? <laughs> so let's go get it.
and love always.